time frames are a set period of time, which covers when we want certain events to occur, such as our phone to ring. We create time frames with different time and date ranges so we can apply them to answering rules, which will then allow you to control how calls are routed depending on the time of day the call occurs. To view and create your time frames, click on the time frame icon in the top navigation menu bar in the manager portal. To create a time frame, click on the add time frame button. You will see the field to name the time frame. Note the name cannot be changed once the rule has been created. Under the name field, you will see three options for when the time frame should be in effect. Always, which will make this rule always in effect 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, 365 days a year. Days of the week and time which allow you to select specific days of the week and hours in those days you want the time frame to take effect. Select the days you would like the time frame to take effect. When you select a day, a blue bar appears. This is when the time frame will be in effect. If you would like the time frame to be in effect from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m., simply slide the end of the blue bar to the correlating time spot. If you would like a break in the middle of the time frame rule, click the plus sign next to the 11.59 p.m. You will see another blue bar appear representing when the time frame will take effect. If we would like to add an hour for a lunch break from noon to 1 p.m., simply slide the blue bar after selecting the days and configuring when you would like time frames to take effect, click save. Selecting specific dates or ranges will allow you to configure a time frame to be in effect for specific dates. Clicking the field to the right of the specific dates or range will bring up a calendar. Select the month, then click on the specific date you want the time frame to be in effect. Then select the hour and minute you would like it to take effect as well. Then select the end date you would like the time frame to stop. Clicking the plus sign will allow you to add more date ranges to the time frame to be in effect. You can change the time frame and time by clicking on the edit icon next to it. To remove the time frame, simply click the delete icon next to it. Once you have created time frames, you can then apply them to your answering rules. If a call comes in when the time frame is in effect, the answering rule will route the call accordingly. If the call comes in outside when the time frame is in effect, it will continue down the list of answering rules until it does find an answering rule with a time frame currently in effect. 